I'll have nightmares if I let myself worry over much. Have you a different destination in mind, Master? Very well. I shall follow your lead instead. The Arisen decides our path. We have but to follow. Oxcarts make for relatively safer travel. Walking everywhere is certainly tiring. In another world, I learned that a forgotten rift stone lies nearby. Shall I escort you there, Master? There's ought to be found there. Can you not see it? We ought to take a closer look. <sighs> this is generally used as a material. the creature was carrying something. You have my protection. One might confidently call that a resounding victory. No doubt this triumph will spur us into the next. A 
as you wish. I shall return directly. Even from this distance. Protect the shipment! Steal <laughs> yourself! Cut the things down! Don't let them touch the shipment! Lee, how did this happen? We must defend the cargo! They're a tenacious lot. That's that then. Well said. I thank you for coming to our aid. That was a tight spot you saved us from. And what luck! Nary a scratch on the wares to show for it. Master, if ever your pack grows cumbersome, no... Surroundings. The old... Yes, yes, of course. We were speaking of places elsewhere. Mayhap tis beyond your ken, but this world of ours is not the real one. This world is a cycle. The dragon emerges, the dragon is slain. Oh, you've come to a dangerous place. Scaly beasts make this their den. We've been dispatched to cull them. A small force ventured inside, though I've seen neither hide nor hair of them since. Seems the battle is hard won. I'll not stop you if you wish to explore, but don't look for my aid if aught goes awry. Oh, my eyes! Can anyone hear me? We need help! I don't want to fall here! Gah, damned lizard! Is this going to draw my last? Asanis! In your debt, sir. Thanks to your valor, I shall live to fight another day. Master would faint were I to return beyond the rift with it. Have you come to save us? Forgive me. I cannot seem to walk of my own accord just now. Would you aid me in reaching the entrance? 
I'll collect that. You needn't trouble yourself. your senses. If aught feels out of place, it could very well be a trap. Naught can threaten us if we watch each other's backs. Their master, Saurians! Flame will accomplish little against this foe. Let my magics grant you an elemental boon. Is there any way to climb up there? I'm not sure what we'll find, but it might be something useful. Master, I believe I could be of aid here. Might I be of assistance? Why are you doing this, Arisen? You went in there to save my fellow soldiers. Well now. I underestimated you, friend. I shall send word of your deeds to the captain. You've done well this day. I thank you. We'll see to the rest of this mess. You need not trouble yourself further. Oh, I'm saved. You have my gratitude, friend. Were it not for your aid, I'd have died a dog's death. At last, we shall all be able to return. I should like for you to see this place as...
chance allow any further harm to come to you. My thanks. Here you are. Something for your trouble. a surprise. Our collection grows. Interesting. I shall have to inform my own master of this. our enemies. Over here, if you would. Here we are. We must 
don't allow ourselves to become complacent. Take each trial as well. Charge ahead, maybe to rush him. Let us take care to move his body. What? Oh! It was but a trick of the light. I knew you would prevail, Master. We can ill afford to grow overconfident. Our foe is not yet out. Treasure chest. Shall we see if we can't make our way over to it? Oi, you then! Trick the boss, give us a hand! Right, then we should aid. We're in your death. Scatter the coffee! A flawless execution! Let us try for the same. You've a strong arm. The goblins are well routed. You have my thanks. It was a simple patrol mission, till we walked into their ambush. Those cursed things caught us entirely unawares. I don't know where we'd be if you hadn't come along. I pray you'll let me repay the favour, if ever there's a chance. Tis done. Well said. Now to report to Captain Brandt. If you wish to meet with this person, I would gladly lead the way. Over here, if you please. say we could sell this for a fair amount of gold whether or not we make the sale is for the arisen to decide have you forgotten something arisen you're looking rather lost
The walls are too close for comfort here. Should we encounter trouble, we would be at a disadvantage. Let us conclude our business and be quit of this place. There is naught to be gained from lingering. Arrived well enough. Where to next? We're here, and none the worse for wear. Greetings, Your Majesty. Have you a moment to speak? much we ought to tend to, if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. You've done a fine job culling those monsters, your majesty. Tis common knowledge among the people that t'was you who delivered them from danger. The number of those who seek out this tavern in the hope of an audience with the arisen grows by the day. Should you continue to display such valor, the day will soon come when Deesa can no longer deny your presence. And ere it slips my mind. Pray, take this. To and with that, our task is done. Indeed, you've culled more than your fair share of monsters. I expect tales of your valor will soon be told in taverns. I concur. There is much we ought to tend to, if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. You will need to infiltrate the palace to gather evidence of Deezer's misdeeds. I hesitate to ask something so dangerous of you, yet I fear we have few other options. I have attempted to do the same through my own channels afore now, though I have yet to uncover so much as a whisper of her plots. Would that I could undertake the task myself, but my station prohibits me from reckless action. What say you, Your Majesty? Might I ask this task of you? I shall ensure that the door to the Queen Regent's office is open between midnight and dawn. Pray use that time to conduct your investigation. Follow me. Still 
Olympic in the lakes. Good evening, sir. I trust you fared all right on the... Getting proper rest is an important duty in it. It is an odd thing to wake after the sun has fallen. Shall we check our packs and be off? Feeling rested, I trust? Sometimes I wonder if I'm cut out for this one. Do you know how long you'll be? I only asked so that I might... You are the Arisen, yes? The captain gave me your description. Follow me! the guards spy you, I will be forced to play my part. Pray be cautious, Your Majesty. Wait for the new equipment to come in.
mindless labor is for mindless men. Some of us get complacent. I train every day. compares to a real battle. Who's there? Pray, keep your voice low. It wouldn't be good for either of us if someone was summoned to come check on me. Could it be that you have come to bring Mother's schemes to light? I, I am Sven, the son of Queen Regent Deesa. Mother has been acting rather strangely of late. I thought to investigate the matter whilst she was away. I gather tis the same for you. I can't imagine what else would have summoned you here. My word! You mean to say that you are the true Arisen? That the Sovereign currently residing in the palace is a pretender? Could Mother have had a hand in that as well? Regent Kin Sven appears to be missing from his chambers. Have you seen him? Me? No, sir. Then start searching, you fool. Should aught befall the Regent Kin, tis us who'll answer to her grace. Forgive me. My absence seems to have made this rather more difficult for us. You ought leave the palace at once. This room turned up little of interest, but I've a mind to look into this further. I shall send word to Captain Brandt if I discover aught you should know. I'll head out first and speak with the Sentinels. Use that opportunity to make good your escape. If that is your destination, we cannot follow. But know that your return is eagerly awaited.
What must needs be done? Someone is looking this way. Is there aught about me that caught their eye? Is north of import. Hmm. I've things to do if you. What brings you here? Come rain or shine, I'll make the best of it. If you want to. Captain Lab, my son, Well met, sir. Greetings, Your Majesty. Have you a moment to speak? much we ought to tend to, if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim. How fared your mission? Was there aught suspicious to be found in the Queen Regent's office? This scrap. It was part of a letter, and from Batal, no less. This alone can prove little, but it is clear that these schemes run deep. To think, Deezer's actions have weighed even on the mind of her own son. Tis a surprise, but a welcome one. Deezer is a, the doting mother before the Regent King. If Regent King Sven is willing to aid us by drawing Deezer's focus, we may be able to gain here more useful information. You have done well, Your Majesty. Though I am limited in the aid I am able to offer, I bid you, Take this. Seems we were right to suspect the Queen Regent. We ought to keep an eye on her in the days to come. That's odd. Phasus. Now there's a name to remember. There is much we ought to tend to. If we are to... Of all those who serve the Queen Regent, there is but one who I have no doubt will lend his support to your Majesty's cause. I refer to Waldar, a magistrate. Many a time as Deza demanded Waldor amend the Code of Vermont to her own benefit. And many a time as the magistrate refused her, for he's loyal to none but the spirit of the law. As a result, he now sits in a cell beneath the palace. Our laws dictate that your majesty is our rightful ruler. Thus, 
As the staunchest supporter of the law known to the palace, I'm quite confident that Waldor will be willing to vouch for your majesty. What say you? Might you be willing to aid me in arranging the magistrate's release? I've prepared a means for you to enter the palace dungeons. Pray, take this. This mission demands the utmost secrecy. Prithee be cautious, your majesty. Should you be discovered, I will be unable to lend aught in the way of aid. As pawns are not permitted within the castle, I will bid you farewell when we reach the entrance. Welcome to Bjorns, and quality is what you need if you want to survive. So before you check the price, just remember... Many thanks. I appreciate the business. Hail, friend. How fare you? Tis not long now ere I am to undertake the trial of archery. I thought it only right to tell you that, as you were the one who gifted me the bow that I'll be using. I was also rather hoping you would consider attending. No one could be worthier of witnessing this milestone in elven archery than you. Ah. But the path to the arbor is not easily found or followed. To be best, I escorted you. There is a log bridge near the ruins where I train. I'll await you on the other side. Come find me when you are ready to make for the sacred arbor, the village of my people. Over here, if you would. Yon path leads not to our destination. If you would prefer to explore, I shall guide you another time. Tis not for us to gain the Arisen's judgment. We must go where we are bid. <laughs> my, my! I'm trapped like a rat in a cage. This arisen's both shrewd and fleet of foot. What? Can't you think of a reason? I'd thought you a keener wit than that. Let's just say there are some who don't want you wandering about as you please. I was to report on your comings and goings, you see. But I suppose that job's over. Now you found me out? So, how about it, friend? Will you let me go? I've no reason to trouble you any further.
Understandable. Still, no harm in asking, was there? Let's get this over with then. I grant you roaring flame. Even I know when to shut my trap. My fate is sealed. Have you business in Batal? Then you, good sir, will require an entry permit. Don't go thinking you can slip through the border checkpoint without one. Too many scoundrels are trying that of late. Trade twixt our nations may be on the upswing, but passage of regular civilians is still closely monitored. So, should you seek entry in future, I bid you take the proper channels. I'm quite sure I wasn't dreaming, but ox carts don't run so late at night. No fear, master. I'll fare all right without you for a little while. Tis not our place to hurry the arisen.
So, you've come. Captain Brandt bade me allow you passage. It is good to be reunited. As soon as my shift's done, I'm off to the tavern. Wait for the new equipment to come in. Can't expect to fare so well every day. it now. I'd hasten home were this not my duty. And have you come to release me from this jail? Who are you? Naho. Uh -huh. Then we are presented with three options. Either the law of our world that allows only one arisen has been upended, or Deezer's arisen is false, or you are lying to me. Have you proof that you are arisen, as you say? Ah. They say the Arisen's breast bears a wound akin to the dragon's claw. 
by that mark, t'would seem tis true. This reminds me of a happening 148 years ago. During the reign of Regent Alphonse, a man named Crusoe appeared and claimed to be arisen. He went before the people, insisting that he, and not Regent Alphonse, was the true arisen, the one fit to lead them as their ruler. And what befell him, you ask? Ha! Crusoe was discovered to be a liar, whereupon his head was liberated from his shoulders on the spot. Aye, I dare say your arrival portends another beheading, but whose will it be, hmm? Escape? But why? Here I spend my days perusing the code and deciphering old texts. I can devote all my time to my own interests. And I need not turn my ear to Deesa's absurd demands. Tis a paradise to me, this cell. That said, if you know of a place with a mountain of tomes I could delve into, I might rethink the matter. Tell me, does that ring any bells? Oh, to think such a place existed. How oh, very curious. Guide me outside, then. If you can deliver me from this pit, I ought to be able to find the rest of the way on my own. I, this should be far enough. My thanks. If you truly are arisen, then I swear to someday repay this debt I owe. Words may be wind, but there's naught else I can offer you at present. Pray visit me if you've the time or inclination. Mayhap the knowledge I've gained reading tomes of Eld could be of some use to you. Never can have too many of Is it true you're the arisen? Only, I seem to recall someone else boasting of being the just be sure you play your part well. A fellow Drake or two, and I reckon. Make it quick. I ain't got all day. I'm feckless, through and through. Some call it culture. I'm calling it I've not blinked once in the last hour. What brings you here? Oh, 
Rest your head. Much to do yet. Just a bit shifty. Hope there'll be a few heavy purses about today. Welcome. Oh dear. I hope the weather holds. There is much we ought to tend to. If we are to strengthen your majesty's... I bear word from Regent Ken Sven, your majesty. He espied the delivery of a suspicious package to a man named Allard. A minister who happens to be one of the Queen Regent's staunchest and most powerful allies in the palace. From the pains he took to remain on scene. Tis plain that Allard wished this delivery kept away from prying eyes. That alone is reason to suspect a connection to Deezer's schemes. We must get to the bottom of it. The Regent Kin intends to call Allard to his chambers come nightfall. He bids you to use this opportunity to search the Minister's chambers and see if there is aught to be learned. What say you, Your Majesty? Are you willing to undertake this task? I shall ensure that the door to the Minister's chambers is open between midnight and dawn. Pray. Use that time to infiltrate and uncover aught worthy of suspicion. We have been entrusted with a task. There is much we ought to tend to, if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. It seems Magistrate Wardor has been safely delivered from his cell. The man's dedication to justice shall doubtless be a great boon to our cause. Mayhap it would be prudent to visit man on occasion and avail yourself of his vast stores of wisdom. He might have knowledge that could benefit you on your travels. Now, would you be so kind as to return the key I lent you? I thank you. Pray. Take this. Consider it remuneration for your majesty's efforts. It's been some time since we last saw the young man who coveted that ornate box. Mayhap we ought to seek him out. Very well. I'll guide you there directly. A guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way.